Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Probert Gaming here, and in today's video, I'm going to be going over uh, some parts of the new update. I'll be explaining the new update briefly, and I'll be going over the best reforge now that you can get on your sword. So, without further ado, let's get into the video. So, very, very, very recently, they, uh, the new mayor, Scorpius, got elected. With Scorpius came the blacksmith workshop being finished, and Scorpius, which gives money and a lot more stuff into dark auctions. He added a lot of stuff in dark auctions. I'll put the, um, what is it called? The, th the update post for form, the thread, in the link down below, so you guys can go look it out yourself. But, basically speaking, they added a bunch of stuff new to the dark auction. They made it so the Dark Auction now has 7 items, instead of the usual 5. They also made it so there was a lot of new things in the Bit Shop and in Dark Auction. In addition to that, they added a new stat. So, in the Dark Auction, they added about 5 new items. First, none of these have been released into the game yet. Um, literally the first Dark Auction, if you can see in my top right corner happened five minutes ago and i was not able to get in as the minimum money needed to get in is 120 mil about however the things you can get from the dark auction there's a now seven things so it would go an item a book an item a book something from scorpius that's special a flower minion and then midas staff so i'm going to go all over all of these briefly a new book they added is counter strike 5 it gains plus 10 defense for 7 seconds on first hit from an enemy. They also added two, they added book bundles, which just have books with, I think, like 5 um, enchanted books with the stat inside, I think. They added the Big Brain Bundle and the Vicious Bundle. Big Brain Bundle grants plus 15 intelligence. That's all we know, as no one has anything from it yet. We have the Vicious a uh, backpack or the book sack which is really good and we have the pl we've got a couple more things there's, there's two of the, two of the biggest ones is the plasma flux this thing is insane it is the best it's better than o overflux it requires a plasma nucleus uh, about a stack of gold teeth and four stacks of enchanted obsidian with an overflux. So, very, very expensive, only for the richest of rich. Next thing they added, I'm gonna see if they have any on auction, but the new a new talisman they added is called the, I probably am butchering this name, the Hegemony Artifact. Basically speaking, it's a legendary artifact, and it doubles all the stats on this reforge of the item. And the final thing is Midas Staff. This thing uh, is a basically overpowered yeti sword. It deals a lot of damage, it costs a lot of mana. Uh, and the more money you spend on it, the better stats it has. And you can spend up to 100 mil to get the max stats. So those are all the items you can get from Dark Auction. In addition to that, they added the Blacksmith Reforge. Which has a bunch of new reforges, which I'll I'll go and but I'll go into some of the best ones. They also added a new stat. The new stat that they added is called ferocity. Ferocity is basically double strike. It's the tiger's pet of double strike. Uh, so ferocity gains a percent chance to double strike enemies. Increments of a hundred increase the base number of strikes. So if you had like a 150 ferocity, you could, you will always double hit and you have a chance to triple hit. I believe that's how it works. So with this, this is basically the tiger pet. And they also made the tiger pet, so you, a lot more of a powered, so you have a 100% chance to get a critical hit. As we see, we have 100% ferocity. The next, so, Ferocity is really cool. There's not a whole lot of ways to get it right now. It says uh, you can get a base Ferocity by exploring the world, 
but we have no clue how we would actually do that. So, we're waiting for that update to come out. And there's a couple ways to get Ferocity. A, from the Ferocity bundle that you can get from a Dark Auction. Or from a Reforge sword. A Reforge sword. Stone. That is called the Dirty Bottle. The Dirty Bottle, you can buy for 100k and it costs 50k to put on a weapon. This is an insane, um, this is an insane reforge, as it gives you, uh, as it gives you bonus attack speed of 15, strength of 12, so it doesn't give you a lot of damage to strength, but it gives you 12 ferocity, which may not seem like a lot, but basically speaking, what this was, that what this is is you have half you have a level 50 tiger pet on your sword is basically what this is because you gain plus because you gain ferocity so you so with this i have a 12 percent chance to double strike now i don't know now the dirty before it can be put onto rods and swords i don't know if it could be put onto bows or anything else like that but I'm sure they'd add a bunch of ways you can do in some insane stuff with the ferocity. In addition to that, they they added a lot of stuff. They uh, added some new things to the bit shop. They also have a tiger pet skin going on right now. But from the bit shop, they have a bits talisman. It's cost 50,000 bits or about 3 mil on auction right now. And you gain a 10% chance to gain double bits. So, every hour, and this depends on how much fame rank you have, uh, I usually gain about 275 bits per hour. Whenever you gain bits, you have a 10% chance to gain double the bits. This will not increase your how much, because you only get a certain amount. Like, for bits, I can only get 5,000. I can only get a certain amount. I can only get five. Point two thousand, but I could get double bits instead of get. So instead of getting two seventy five, I'd get five seventy, ish. Just in that, it's also a talisman, which is very nice. They also added, basically speaking, expertise to, uh, the game. This is basically expertise except for a sword, or not a sword, a pickaxe. You get one extra mining exp, and drop an enchanted block every. 400 blocks you mine Yeah, so That's really good Compact cannot be combined uses. Yeah, that's good in addition to that. They added the builders wand. I Don't really know what this is, but I'm pretty sure it's Like if I was to I'm just gonna go get a stick really quick just for an example Alright. If let's just pretend that this stick is my builder's wand. Uh don't ask about this. Uh you would click on a block and then it would you'd right click on it, you put blocks inside of its inventory, and then it would build out in directions. So very, very, very useful for building. So this update was very, very big and is pretty insane. Most of the other um Anything I didn't cover about, or you have more questions on, just A, leave a comment down below, or check out the link in the description. Uh, and, yeah, sorry that this video is unedited. I know it's not in full screen. I don't care to record it. This update came out, like, not very long ago. So, yeah. But, without further ado, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.